Hello guys and welcome back to Let's play Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons with Miox Fu and Ooh, before I forget, now that we actually have all four seasons, we can do a couple of things. Like Winter! Power of Spring! Ow! There's actually a real reason why I changed it to spring, besides just ow, I thought I had my sword equipped. Besides just being like, oh, here's are pretty cool. I can change to I like likes go away. Danger, like likes well yeah, danger now. Danger, 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 Will Robinson. Stranger danger, stranger danger. Yeah, now we can actually get up here. Which is Ah oh, no 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 Stranger Danger, Stranger Danger. <laughs> um what I wanted to do a little while ago, but of course we couldn't do that without this flower of goodness and awesome and guess what? We still can't do it. <laughs> we need a way to get another item. Get oh get oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, I forgot we actually need another item to do that. Because as you saw, as you might have seen, that little do 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 that little block next to us had a strange S marking on it. And it seemed to be made of metal. I wonder what it could be. Let's see what you have to say, Sakura. The seasons of holodrama are all in disorder. Spring, summer, what will come of it all? Even I cannot see. <laughs> oh, that came out much better than I thought. Um, I'm trying to think who reminded me of it. And eh, no, that can wait. <laughs> it's probably gonna see this video and be like, show the damn thing already. We've been past it like five times. Yay. It can wait. <laughs> no, really, I can wait a few. It can wait for a little while because I'm not sure if I'm even gonna be doing that. And that's gonna be. I'm just gonna stop now because there's like probably like a bunch there. It's the, the five people who actually watch my episodes are probably going to be like, what is he talking about? Except the one guy who knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm getting tired. Let's just put it that way. I should probably go to bed soon. But I want to get to the next dungeon before doing anything else. So I'm going to get to the next dungeon before doing anything else. Is there anything down here? I don't think so. No. I think there's another diving thing that we can do in there, but we can do that later. Alright, now as you can see there is there are eight bushes stacked around each other. I believe this is actually yes, a gaseous seed. Planting place thing. Oh yes, that's right. Before I forget, we want to actually put our green holy ring back on because we might run into enemies that we need it for. But as you can see, these mushrooms are no longer those gross colors that they were earlier with, like, the cracks all through them, which means that we can now pick them up and throw them and hoist them over our head. Because now we are at level 5, the Unicorn's Cave. And we got some ass to kick in this place. Um, If I can remember what kind of ass it is we're kicking. Oh yeah, this is one of the first really open dungeons. Oh, these guys too. I These guys aren't really hard, it's just I'm not a f fan of them. Because you gotta wait for them to turn their back and then hit them that way. Ow! And they can just sometimes turn unpredictably. And it's just not fun sometimes. That's all. Alright, so for this chest, we have to get our trusty Pegasus seeds and hope we don't fall into a pit of death and doom and destruction because this is actually kind of hard. Actually, I did really well comparatively. Okay, come on. Okay, found the compass. I usually have a lot more trouble with that than I did right then. Um, 
you know what? I'm actually gonna see if I can get back. Usually, yeah, usually I just drop down like that, but I figured, yeah, give it a shot, because I can stand to not lose health. Man, what could that mean? Well, we'll find out later, won't we? <laughs> You're expecting me to tell you what the treasure is in this 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 dungeon, weren't you? Okay, we do have to go. I wasn't sure if there was another door on the right or not. But we do have to go this way. I think we want to go this way first, too. Oh, you're the good ones. You're the ones that don't jump. Thank you. Get out of our trusty slingshot. Boomerang, you came back! Um. Ooh, hey, chest. Small key, that's pretty handy. Ow, ow, ow. You can die. And no, we cannot push you. Lock. That's okay. Ow. Don't be there when I run into you. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember much about this dungeon at all, to tell you the truth. Because, again, this is one of the more... I think one of, one of the more confusing ones, just because... It's a... well, it is a linear dungeon. I can't deny that, but it's a very... A very open dungeon. Like, you saw some of those earlier areas, they were just... There was just a lot of area that we could go in besides. Now, this is something else I don't understand. These things right down here. Because... In a little bit, we're actually going to be down there. And that these these are always going to be in our way. And I have not found a way to get rid of these. If you know a way to get rid of these little metal bales right here, let me know. Because I've always been curious if there's some way that you can actually get rid of them. Which I was just too stupid to figure out as a kid. And am too stupid to figure out now. Um, but yeah, let me know. Uh, leave it in a comment or something. If Again, if you know. The more you know. Can we kill you? Can we kill you? No. We can't kill you. Okay, that's that's lovely. <sighs> More enemies we can't kill. Isn't isn't that lovely? Isn't that great, Cans? Well, let's go this way. Shoot. Attila the money. Mummy. Mummy mummy mummy. Mummy mummy mummy. Mummy 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 mummy. Well at least he stayed in a pretty set pattern. Ow. I don't care, anyway. We got the dungeon map! Let's see if any- Oh, why would they put- Hmm. Is this bombable? No, okay. I don't think any of these are pushable. Guess not. Guess I'm just pushing at straws. Oh! Okay, nothing down there, either. Let's keep going this way. See what we can see. <laughs> this dungeon really just scares me as well, because there's just so many enemies flying around in every area at any time. So there's really, like, no safe place in this, ow, dungeon unless you go underwater. And again, that's just like, ah, oh, I don't want, I don't want to die. Thank you, please, thank you. Actually, I thought I was about to die right there. Is there anything even up here? No. Why did I even waste my time going up there if there's nothing up there? Because I wanted to make sure. Blur. Alright. And we got the magnetic gloves. They're magnetic might. Attracts and repels. Press the button to reverse polarity. There we go. This is by far the most interesting item they've put in this game. Because you know what? You see how that says north right there? I'm gonna go all the way over here on the other side of the room. Bam! 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 It's just fun to play with this thing later on. Especially because... 
I'll, I'll show you when we run across it, won't I? Because there's one. There's gonna be one not far from here at all. In fact, it's gonna be, I would almost say, on the other side of this puzzle right here. Yeah, that's the other thing I've tried doing, like, I've tried actually using the magnetic glove to try to get rid of those, but no. I have no idea what, what is with those bales of metal hay. Again, someone tell me, because I am infinitely curious. Don't die. Don't die. Okay, we're good. See? See? This this is ridiculous right here. You know, just everything is about that is just awesome <laughs> to me. Oh, you can't follow us, little guy. Sorry about that. Alright, let's just get this chest. Let's just get this chest. And I'm gonna end it here, guys, and next time I will Hopefully next time. Hopefully next time we will finish up the unicorn's cave. Oh hey, see it's another. It's a unicorn, like the boss is in the horn. <laughs> it's making sense now. But I will see you guys next time, and we will finish the unicorn's cave. Hopefully, it again. As much as. I think it's confusing. It's a small dungeon. Like, it doesn't have the five freaking floors that the other one did. Three, I know, but... Still. And I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons with me, Magneto! No, Orc, um... <laughs> orc. Oh, Fu. Take it easy, guys.